Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa and today's video is a Coffee Critic episode 7. to Indiana from Kentucky to visit this coffee shop called Proper Coffee. And we are on our way. We're gonna review them. We're gonna try their coffee. We're gonna experience Indiana coffee. And we'll see you guys when we get there. Okay guys, we just got to Proper Coffee and it's a little bit rainy out. So we're gonna do our best to show you the outside of the building. But I also wanna let you guys know that I am adding a new critique section to my coffee critics. And that is gonna be the coffee shop websites. So I'm gonna start critiquing their websites and I'm also gonna start um, telling you guys the reviews that they have. So this place has, I think it was mainly five star reviews. There was a few four and one star reviews, but um, all the recent reviews were all five stars. So we're gonna head in and we're gonna try out some coffee. Coffee Clan is gonna try her coffee. Let me. I forgot. This is the um, cinnamon. Honey, no, it's honey cinnamon ice latte. Okay. It's five dollars. Five dollars. Mm. It's good, but I feel like it's really watery. That could be because of the ice. Okay. I might have to like mix it a little bit. Okay. Uh, what would you give it? What would you rate it? I can't taste the cinnamon. It tastes more like a rustic. I don't like that. Okay. Yeah, it tastes it tastes more like a. Uh, it doesn't have much flavor to it, to be honest. So out of five, out of five. Like a, a three out of five. I a think. three out of five? Yeah. That's low. What would you rate the overall place? I did like a 4.5. 4.5? Alright, take another sip and tell me what you think again. Is it still a 3? <laughs> still a 3? It's just really watery. We'll do a check-in after with you guys and tell us what we think. But it looks like there might be like a coffee ice cube in there, kind of. Oh, really? You know what I'm saying? Right there. A little peaky. But anyway, I really like mine. So we're going to finish our lattes. We're going to do some work. And we'll check back in with you guys after. <laughs>
time to check out the website. Looking at the website, I really like how the home page looks. I like how they have the shop now button and the pictures are very aesthetically pleasing. I think that their products are pretty fairly priced and they do have good selection. Okay guys, so we just got done finishing up our coffee. We were gonna film the outro in the store, but then it got really crowded. So our final, final thoughts on the place, proper coffee. All in all, I would probably rate it, I gave it a 4.9, but now that it's like sitting in my stomach a little bit, I'm gonna give it a 4.8, just because it was a little bit heavier on my stomach, it felt like, and the place was very unique. It was very modern, really, really cool. Honestly, probably like the coolest coffee shop I've ever been to. I really, really like their style. What did you think? Oh no. I would rate, um, the coffee that I had was good, but it, it was just a little too watered down, so I don't know if that was because of who made it or just how it is, but I didn't care for the coffee, but the interior was probably my favorite part. And as far as location as well, I think it's in a really good spot. It's like connected yeah. to some like hairdresser thing. Yeah, so it looks like there's a lot to do in the area if mm -hmm. you just grab a quick coffee and go, or if you like stay and chill. Like There's actually a an at home store which oh. is basically like a home goods oh. or like a home goods on crack it is huge oh my god like definitely grab yourself a coffee and check it out um one thing Keep that your i also credit card in the freezer <laughs> one thing that i also thought that i really liked about the coffee shop is it definitely was a place where you can go and like sit for a long time and get some work done which is really good for me and other influencers who just want to sit down with their laptop and do some networking get some get some editing done, stuff like that. They had really comfy seating. I'll pop their Instagram up on the screen right here. Um, shout them out, follow them on Instagram. Their website was really nice. Their website was really nicely laid out. I thought it was nicely done. It had prices on it. They have merch that you can buy. And all oh, in all, yeah, just really, a really, really cute yeah, just a really, really nice place for you oh, to go and, and have, have a cup candles. of coffee. They Hand, have handmade really candles nice. from what, California? And they're like, so they're made with soy or something. Yeah, know. their candles were great too. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. That does it for this episode of Coffee Critic, and I will see you guys next video. Until then, drink coffee, travel often, and I love you.